Hello, my name is Pony7 and welcome to Steel Fury Karkov 1942. Uh, this is going to be taking the place of Silent Hunter 5 for a little bit, just so that, because, um, some of you may be aware, but I'm very possibly leaving on a trip to go visit family extremely shortly, and Silent Hunter 5, that last video that I did, took 3 hours to get 20 minutes of footage for, basically. So I can't get that and have videos ready for uh, the time that I'm gone at the exact same time. Just, just not just not enough time. So this is going to be taking the place because these missions are generally shorter and they're nice and quickly to do. Um, so yes, uh, initial situation of this mission. Uh, Kampfgruppe Brett Panzer Regiment uh, Panzer Regiment 201st of 23rd Panzer Division 6th Army Southwest of Peshkanoi, I think. Main objective is to attack the enemy's flank and capture Peshkanoi. Uh, op order 13th of May 1942, map scale 1 to 100. Uh, Red Army's 12th Rifle Division of the 38th Soviet Army, supported by presumably 13th Tank Brigade, is advancing from Peshkanoi towards Verni Raganka. Raganka? Russian reserve units respond near Pesoy, ready to support the main push. The enemies have a strong point in Piskenta. Uh, activator with infantry regiment 331, 130, 131. Security area and advanced wars there. We'll commence May. Artillery will be deployed in the force southwest of launching a fire mission against the village at 1230. About 1250. Air support, none. Your mission, your platoon will support the right flank of the main assault group. Actually, the left flank of the main assault group. Attack the enemy's flank and rear. Unless we are on the right flank of the main assault group. Which is possible. The enemy's flank and rear. Eliminate the enemy and capture the primary objectives. Destroy anti tank guns, units, and MG nests. Breach enemy defenses. Commander of 6th Army. General. General Lieutenant Frederick William von Polis, commander of the 21st Pain Division. General Lieutenant Hans Fair von Boingberg Legensfield? That's a real mouthful. But anyway, let's go to the mission. Hansa, forward. Yes, we are playing in. Yes, capture the hill. Thank you. Someone's shooting at us, shooting already. That's not great. Then again, that's probably just the infantry. Yes, we are in the Stug right now. Unfortunately, the Stug is one of the vehicles that does not have an interior cockpit, so... I think, though, that this has vision slits. Yeah, there we go. We have some vision in the front still. That's good. Over, we are going to turn out. No, don't. They're over the hill somewhere. Turn out. Forward. And that's the hill we're supposed to be capturing. And there's a forest off to the left of it. Let's get going faster. Don't want to fall behind the other stugs of the unit. At least not too poorly. What was that? I don't know what that was, but that sounded like something got hit. 
I don't see any anti tank guns yet. Oh, there's an anti tank gun. I think. That looks like an anti tank gun right there. That's the under the screen. Now, are we looking at it? Let's try there. No, that was over. That was short. Short again. And also a little bit to the right. That was just over. <laughs> that was also just over. Come on, there we go. That's a good solid hit. Put one more shot into it, just to make sure. And we'll turn out. And keep going. Don't want to fall too far behind. You can actually see a Panzer IV already advancing up the hill, and our, the friendly Stugs are already part way up. I don't see anything over there. So let's keep going. Hey, oh, what's that up there? Oh, I think there's a push. There's friendly infantry. Enemy infantry over there. Looks like I want to try and catch up. Hopefully, we will be able to. Oh, there's an MG thirty four in front. I think either that or just an anti-tank gun. I think that might be an anti-tank gun because there's an MG34 off his left side. Now to keep a lookout for tanks in the area because there was a 13th tank brigade was set to be in support. So hopefully we don't run into them directly to the face, but it may happen. The infantry is actually getting out of our way. Good on them. However, we do have to be careful about enemy infantry, especially at close range with an anti-tank gun, because we don't have a coaxial machine gun of any kind, at least not on this stud. So... We can't do anything if an enemy uh, infantry pops up with an anti-tank grenade right off, right off our flank as we drive past. Come on, get up the hill. We're missing out on all the engagement, come on. Faster, please. Nope. I guess this is as fast as we're going. Well, alright then. It's a bit of a sounding right now. It sounds very good. I think there's something over to the left. So I'll rotate over to the left and head up this way. 
Just run over some barbed wire fences, give the infantry some a clear path through. Okay, they're definitely engaging something. I'm gonna turn in right now. Just so I don't get my head shut off. However, this does very much limit our field of view. Whoa, whoa. We took a shot from something there. I think. Something exploded. Oh, there's an anti-tank gun right in front of us. Where is it? There it is. Just make sure it's dead. Okay, that is a German tank or unit. Okay, the hill has been captured. Yes, I accidentally uh, stopped the recording there. Because uh, my start and stop recording buttons are. Oh! Ooh, no, anti tank gun, anti tank gun. Turn in, turn in. And that looks like Soviet infantry as well. Oh, some more high explosive. Nope. Oh, well, there's another trench. Oh, there goes a PPSH. A oh, little bit high. <laughs> Up. There we go. There's the anti-tank gun. I think that hit the bush. Yeah, that's hitting the bush that's right in front of us. The so forward a little bit. Okay, that's actually very far away. <laughs> Put another shot into that anti tank gun, just to be sure. Okay, why are we shooting all over the place? Okay, we are absolutely all over the place. I no longer know where anything is. Let's turn out so we can actually see. There's an anti tank gun somewhere. Something burning in the town. There's an infantry running.
There's a trench over there. I'm trying to find out where the anti-tank gun is to see something shooting. Where is it? Surprising that we haven't seen any tanks yet. Considering the uh, oh, anti-tank gun right there. Just over. Short, early. There we go, that's a good solid hit. And it's down. So one last anti-tank gun. Oh, there's, that was a shot from right in front. Oh, there's another anti-tank gun. Let's turn in. Switch to the gunner. That was a good hit. There we go, that anti tank gun is now well and truly down. And I don't see anything else. Oh, there, there's a Panzer IV. That was a little bit long. There we go. Nice little shot there. And I don't see anything else, so there is still some of the tree over there. So we'll pull a, one last round. Oh, we hit the tree. Alright, well then, Commander, turn out again. So we can actually see. That guy's just driving about. Kinds of four backing away from something, burning buildings. That's a T34. Get that ahead. Turn in, gunner. I don't know if that's alive or not. So just lob a shell in order to get rid of that shell. That's not. A, that's not dead. That's still shooting. There we go, that just hit on the side. That's a good solid shot into its engine. You can actually see the damage to the, the penetration hole. Let's see if we can put one into the turret. Oh, I think that one actually shattered. Another good solid shot into the back. I think that one just missed. I'm willing to bet that it is now well and truly dead. I will put one more shot into it just to be absolutely certain. And then. Well. Now one more because we still have to get uh, that one out. But then we'll reload high explosive. Oh, 
And if it's one, oh look, there's one of the Stugs. It's still alive, which is good. I don't see anything yet. That's the same 334 we were already shooting at, so... That's well and true. There we go, mission completed. Let's take a quick look at the statistics. Uh, actually... We took some friendly fire, I think. We took a couple 9mm bullets. How'd we do? We fired 44 shots, got 25 hits. Uh, we took 2 hits, those will be the 2 9mm. We destroyed um, 3 anti tank guns and a T 34 Mod 1941. And we killed 29 enemies. So that was a very successful mission. We. Uh, oh, this one is actually immobilized. Oh, he lost his track. All right then. Oh, he got grenaded. That's why. Took a grenade. And he's doing fine. Although it looks like he took some anti uh, tank gun hits. Uh, Verber 1. Uh, that was abandoned. Wasn't actually destroyed. The crew just left. Killed by. What was it killed by? Oh, it was killed by uh, Panzer 4F2. Uh, this guy... This is actually still perfectly fine, he just... buggered off. And then... Here is this guy. Who we put a lot of shots into the, uh... rear of. Oh, he took a lot of shots into the rear. That's yeah, completely destroyed. And then this anti-tank gun was abandoned. Uh, abandoned. This one's actually perfectly fine still. Although the crew is all dead, and then... This one was abandoned, and it's flipped upside down. And that one was abandoned. And there's an F1 who got some infantry, but nothing else. Uh, he got some infantry. And this one got an anti tank gun and a tank. So good on him. And then Panther 1, which was destroyed. Then Leopard 4. Which was abandoned, and abandoned, and abandoned. Then we're back to us. So, quite a successful mission. I'm. We'll pick another vehicle. It may be, again, it could be something completely radically different. But I'd like to thank you all for watching, and hope to see you all next time.